question for you guys. Would you ever travel into the future if you could? Definitely. No, I travel into the past. Alec, if you could travel into the future, how far would you go? Probably like 300 years. How about a billion years? No, no I wouldn't. Way. No, That's, That's too scary. scary. I always wanted to know what would happen a billion years in the future, and we're going to find out. One million years in the future. One billion would years. all of the oceans have evaporated? Or would it have become one giant no. water world? No way. No. Okay, now, what about one billion years? No. I could survive that. Would no. there be any humans left? It's all robots. Of course. I don't think or so, bro. There's no way. they settled in other parts oh, of the galaxy? Elon Musk. Nah. On the moon. This that was the moon. What if? And here's what would happen. If you traveled one billion years, oh my god! Oh the my god! I'm okay, crazy. guys, guys, what are your predictions? What's gonna happen a billion years in the future? I think that civilization is going to be destroyed, bro. There's too much technology. There's too many like nuclear things going on. At one point, someone is gonna get their hands on something crazy and skadoosh. Alec, we are the smartest. We are the best. We are like pretty much like a parasite that'll never go away. Well, maybe some people will survive, but maybe it'll only be a couple. We're gonna go back in the past and have like no technology eventually and it's all just gonna build back up and then crumble down. It's all gonna be AI. We're gonna all be robots with our brains, our consciousness inside of robots. It's over, it's GG's. I'd put myself inside of a robot if I could. Let's face it. The chances of any humans being around to greet you when you arrive one billion years into the future? Zero. Are pretty low. No, come on. Very low. You're going to be the only Several person alive. Key existential threats face the human race. Like what? If we want to be around the Sonic robots, we'll need to That's endure not, them all. At least for 5 billion years. We've seen how much we've struggled to come together just to survive a global Nukes. pandemic. So, how do we have any chance of enduring the threats of climate change, overpopulation, yep. global nuclear yep. war, killer asteroids and comets, natural ice ages That's and a lot. The this sun is scaring getting me. a whole lot This hotter. is scaring me. Well, this is scaring let's me. Let's take a look into the future and okay. find out. No, guys, okay, I don't okay, like this. Fine, I don't Alex. like it's this. Be fine. We're only Just going 10,000 years. 10, <sighs> years from now, we're going to run into a big problem called the Deca Millennium Bug. I have no idea what no! that is. In the year 10,000 AD, software encoding the AD calendar year won't encode dates with more than four decimals. Really? Remember Y2K? Yeah, it's just like that. Except, hopefully, no. we won't panic as much this time around. What are we gonna do? That will be fine. Side, in 10,000 oh. years, genetic differences and traits between humans will no longer be regional. Traits oh, like wow. skin and hair color will be evenly distributed around the world. Huh. Maybe that will help us all get along. No! There's gonna be no more gingers! I didn't see one person with red hair! Alec, I'm so <laughs> they sorry. showed yeah, it! Like they the to you. Except I think they're going hair. extinct, Alec. They they're gonna go extinct the next 20 years. Ah! Alec, once you go bald, way, Alec, ah! it's over. The only way you don't become extinct, you need to become like the Jesus of gingers, okay? You need to get you and all the other gingers, and you gotta go on a little ginger island, and you guys just gotta do your thing there forever. Why? My I'm so sorry, Alec. If anything, just think of yourself as a rare breed. Fine, yeah, you guys are normies. Everyone looks like you guys. I'm like cool and look different. Exactly. See, they're gonna look back on you in the history books and they're gonna be like, that guy is extinct. He was so cool. His legacy on that Syra channel, that was insane. Oh, that, yeah. They're gonna do Harvard studies about you, Alec. You guys know like the elephant man? I'm gonna be like the new elephant man. Possibly a hippo or elephant man. Finally. 20,000 years into the future? Oh, here we go. None of the current languages will be recognizable. Huh? Future languages will only contain 1% of the core vocabulary what? words of their present day counterparts. How do they know that? 50,000 years from stuff. now will mark a new glacial period for the Earth, which will start a new ice age. Oh, I thought my global gosh. warming. The globe no, okay, is warming, right. I thought. Are we surviving an ice age? I thought the globe is warming. How is it going to be an ice age? Well, it's probably warming, and then it'll get really cold. Yep. Oh, that's a good thought. It's called climate change, dummy. It's changing. Yeah, it it's not up, just going to be hot. It goes up and down, Alex. Yeah, like but a people warm. keep saying it's going to get too hot for civilization and that we need to stop it from getting hot. But he's, he's saying, like, the first bad thing that's going to happen is it's going to get cold. Cold. This is 50,000 years into the future, Alec. Not tomorrow. God, use your brain, you ginger. Where a falls will There's have a reason why it goes extinct. into Lake Erie completely. And interestingly, a full day on Earth will also increase by one second at this point in time. Okay, so who cares about that? For activities. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> 
Oh boy. In 200,000 oh years, wow. the Lo'ihi volcano will rise that thing just above exploded. the water to form a new island in Hawaii. Okay, cool. Oh, sweet. Ooh. And in 500,000 years, out Hawaii. we should go there when that shout happens. Shout out Hawaii, bro. A asteroid with a diameter greater than one kilometer will hit Earth. Unless what? we can prevent How do they know? It. How do they know? It's probably heading towards us right now. Yeah, it is coming re immediately right now. Can't they see no, the wait. telescope light years away? They you can't. Know what they no, 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 but I'm pretty sure because they can track asteroids pretty much like to a T. And a lot of asteroids these days, they'll like come close to Earth and they'll pass us, right? But then every year they get a little bit closer yep. and a little bit closer because they're coming around the sun. They're all circling, circling the us and they're going to corner us. And then if we don't do anything, if we don't get a giant laser or we, if we maybe send all of our gingers and we shoot them at it to block it... <laughs> It's the only way we can stop it. Adam, don't <laughs> laugh at that. Because now he's going to do it again and again. You can't egg him on. Just also, saying, bro, there needs to be a mass extinction event. All we have to do is build one super giant mega fan that blows out into the you know, outer space. So that whenever anything's coming our way, just <laughs> blow it away. <laughs> you want to get blown? By some fans. The resulting crater will be no less than 400 <laughs> kilometers across. Oh, See, one my giant fan will blow that away. Just think of a giant fan. Unbreathable. Exploded everywhere. That's so like my toilet after Chipotle. To can confirm. And in case that's not Don't enough, ask me why, but I can in confirm. one million yes, years, a million. we'll likely have another super volcano eruption. Yes! Large enough to still assuming people this? are alive here. So there's a super volcano in Yellowstone, right? That a lot of people are scared of? I'm not scared yeah. of it. I'll, I'll jump in right now. So if that ever explodes, I'm pretty sure, like, everything's gonna die. Well, Jack, no. this is a million dying. years in the future. No. You're already gonna be dead. I'm sorry. I know, but, like, let's say that I'm not. Let's say in 50 years they figure out how to upload our consciousness to a robot. I'll live forever. No, your consciousness will. You'll be dead. If you had the ability to upload your consciousness to a robot, would you do it? That's not you. Don't do that. For real. <laughs> Adam, let him talk. Okay, hear me out. Do I have to then, do, like, is my body now gone, or can I just, like, copy and paste my consciousness into a robot? So it's like a clone. Yeah, that is it's exactly like a clone, me. But it's oh, not yeah, really no, 100%. you. 100%. As long as I don't die, I'd be Wait, okay with what? that. But you would just keep, like, cloning yourself, essentially. Yeah, no, I'd make a million of me. You have 3,200 cubic right. kilometers of ash. It would produce enough lava to fill 75% of the Grand Canyon. Oh my gosh. This would be similar to the Toba eruption that almost wiped out humanity 70,000 right. years ago. Almost, almost. But like oh, Jack said, we are parasites. We can't die. Beetlejuice will have exploded into Beetlejuice? a supernova by this time. There's a star called Beetlejuice? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's awesome. Making it visible from Earth even during the daytime. <laughs> <laughs> cool. Here we go. We're going in two million, million years in the future. Humanity Let him talk, Adam. Settlements throughout the solar system. This For real? also means that if populations oh on oh, that looks like Minecraft. have remained like separate, Whoa! humans That's may sick. have evolved into other species Whoa! adapted to wow. this specific world think that that's how it works in Star Wars? Do you guys think that, like, Star Wars is so far in the future that, like, everybody in Star Wars, all the aliens, Dar Jar Binks, Yoda, they're just, like, evolved humans? No. That could be. Wait. They just adapt to, like, whatever planet they live on. That was not an evolved human. Genetics change and change and change. At some point, someone did something with a fish. Maybe the fish evolved. And then we had fish babies? Or that person just ate way too much blue dye. That's true. It happens with flamingos and shrimp, so why can't yep. it happen with us? Exactly. Sometimes I poop green. It's gonna be okay, Adam. But it is very cool to think that if we do survive millions and then maybe be a billion years in the future, we're going to be so evolved to the point where we're not going to look anything like we do today. I hope not, for your, your own sake. I think you're evolving, guys. We're evolving, guys. This is a form of evolution. I, this is I the future. <laughs> look at it. <laughs> this is all your futures. Sorry, guys. I'm just trying to be really years, years, A huge part of Eastern Africa oh my gosh. will break off, forming a new Pangea! ocean base. No. What about In Madagascar? Million years, oh my gosh. Oh, yeah. Africa will collide Whoa. with Eurasia, closing off the Mediterranean That's pretty Sea. pretty cool. <laughs> and and what is Eurasia? mountain range will form <laughs> Europe and Asia. Land masses. This mountain range may include a mountain taller than Mount Everest. Wow. So isn't that insane that like what we're watching right now, that's going to happen over like millions of years, probably. Yeah, the tectonic plates only move like an inch a year or something. So it'll take millions of years for them to. That's what happened with Mount Everest. Crazy big. So it, it's already happened before. Mount Everest is still growing like a millimeter a year or something. Yeah, but like every simulation that we always watch of like, oh, the tectonic plates are going to cause all this chaos. It's like, how could that happen when they're moving so slow? True. It's like, it's like two bowling balls going at one little tiny centimeter per second. Just. Out in space, Mars will collide with its moon. Phobos. Resulting oh, in it GG's developing Nash. a ring system like Saturn's. Oh, cool. 
I like that. That would be sweet. I wish we had a ring. That'd be awesome. In 60 million yeah, years, I, I wish we had a ring system, too. The Canadian too. and American Rockies will have eroded entirely. Hey. Wow. Ew, they're like melting. Years, all Hawaiian islands will be below the no. water. No. Bye -bye, Hawaii. No, Hawaii. That's actually Hawaii. kind of a really long time, though. 80 million years for them to sink? I thought it would be way sooner. I feel like at that point, they could figure out a way to survive. It's called a boat, Alec. Yeah, make a raft <laughs> or something. Well, not even that. Couldn't they just, like, build out the island and just, like, bring a bunch of rocks? And All right, keep Hawaii. You have 80 million years to prepare. Build boats. Got lots of them. Good luck. Put, put Adam in charge. Good luck, soldiers. I'm on my way. Adam's in charge of the boats. None of them. What if I just start freaking out in Hawaii? They all sink. Like, guys, we got to prepare. We're sinking. Ah, it's going down one millimeter a year. You just start whispering in everyone's ear. I'm going to die. <laughs> you know how to swim. <laughs> sure, you're going to need this soon. An asteroid similar to the one that killed the dinosaurs 66 no. years ago will likely hit Earth. Shoot. One that is 10 kilometers <laughs> wide. It. I can't believe In that. 250, 250 million, million. Years, all of Earth's continents will be fused together like Pangea. Nice. Except I like that. Yeah. Out. We need to stop it now. Pangea Ultima. That but is how world peace happens, bro. Because wow. In 400 to 500 million years, Pangea Ultima will separate again. Aww. Ah, can't ever stay together, can it? No. Just when you think it's together, they break up. That's just like my It's parents. just like on Christmas time. In 500 to 600 million years, oh. <laughs> a gamma yeah. ray burst will likely occur within 6,500 years. Yo, what is this? An alien invasion? <laughs> wait, wait, <laughs> Whoa, we just got blasted. First off, who is saying that this is going to happen? Second off, what did we just get hit with? <laughs> An alien plasma beam. Oh, no. I think that was Ultron, bro. Dude, we just got absolutely This is on. when the Avengers takes place. Yeah. <laughs> like, how do we defend against that? Let alone global warming. Wait, play that again. See the giant meteor. I believe in, in Elon Musk, bro. He will save us. Million years, we just need a couple cyber trucks. A gamma ray burst will likely occur a, within a six gamma ray burst? light years from a gamma ray burst. I think that happens when like black holes explode. They just release insane amount of energy, and if we're in the crossfire, boom, a quasar. Quasar, that's the word for it. Yeah, just like. Pew. Just like shoot That's what I'm action. partially scared of. Like, how do we know if there's a black hole that just randomly explodes and then we're, we get caught in the crossfire and GG's, it's over. And, and blink um, of an eye. It's probably not going to happen in our lifetime, Alec. If we upload our AI or consciousness to AI, it will happen in our lifetime, Adam. No. Do you think that's going to happen, Jack? Like, realistically, you think that'll happen? They're already working on it. You ever hear of Neuralink? Yes. I cannot wait to be uploaded and I'm a robot and I could just do anything ever. Dude, it is imagine, scary. Imagine just being a robot. You don't have to worry about pain. You don't got to worry about anything. But then, are you really? living exactly That's a whole new video are you still even alive from earth if it strikes earth it could damage the ozone layer and trigger a mass extinction 600 million years Come from on. now Team earth. moon will be so far from earth that total solar eclipses will no longer be possible no that's okay by me and the sun's That's increasing it? luminosity will have raised temperatures oh. on earth so much oh that my it gosh plate oh my gosh oh gosh I don't like this. That looks in scary. Million okay. years. Can we stop going into the Carbon future? I think we should stop. Drop dramatically and photosynthesis. Everything is dying. Will no longer be possible. Jack, remember what? when you said you wanted to do go here? You would die. Okay, okay. Wait, photosynthesis would be possible. W wouldn't they just? Wouldn't we just evolve? Wouldn't we just evolve over time? If it's if it's happening really really slow, didn't Darwin say that we'll we'll adapt to our environment? So we'll just get used to the sun. We'll just be able to reflect it. Maybe we'll turn like into mirrors. There's no adapting to this, Jack. This is an end game. No, this is it. Boys, it's been a pleasure. You think MBB will still be around? It will always be around. Guys, if you're watching this in the year 600 million AD. Make sure you guys smash like for us, okay? Free oxygen and ozone will disappear from the atmosphere, and complex life on Earth will die. What about Adam? Adam could survive and that finally, then, right? In I one think so. I'm not complex. Years, the sun's luminosity will have increased by 10%. Oh, no. And the average temperature on Earth oh, no. will be 47 degrees Celsius. Oh, my gosh. Our atmosphere what is will that? feel like in a dead That's boiling. Person. Our oceans it's pretty high. Evaporate. That's probably like a hundred. Yeah, look, just thirty. Pockets of water at each of the poles. No. There's no water left. This is what happened to Mars. Yes, exactly. That's true. There used to be water on Mars, and then it all evaporated. Oh no, it all froze. We turned into Mars. <laughs> when Did it freeze or evaporate? I don't machine, remember. It all froze. Prepared to take in a planet Earth that looks nothing like the that one you remember. Oh, that's scary, bro. I don't want to so see that. So black will be gone. Hopefully, 
living its best life on some other far off planet. That's where I'm gonna live. We're we'll we'll be on the moon. Intense dude. heat, lack of water, Ooh, and we would lack still be of breathable air. Do you guys think if we did make it to another planet, we would still make YouTube videos? I thought there's a vlog there. React to Z Arcade <laughs> from yeah. Moon. Yeah, probably. What a, I got <gasps> skills. Guys, imagine golf on the moon. Gravity's gonna that be so would much be different. Sick. That ball's gonna fly. You probably Let's hit it 40 yards. Let's do it. Imagine that YouTube video. Oh, we gotta make it happen, guys. Come on. Okay. Five likes and we'll do it, guys. Come on. Let's go. Earth will be uninhabitable. No. No. So you probably shouldn't stay Ooh. too long. What is this, in a billion Instead, years? You should head out to yeah. see the rest of the solar system. Maybe you'll find your fellow humans there. Or some other oh. intelligent e life. Oh. But that's a story for another what if. Wait, but what would happen if the sun exploded? I feel like everybody would probably have to smash like. I feel like everybody wants to know that. And if you guys do want to know, click right here. No!